Yes, sir. It's your boy B. Hayes back with another one, guys. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. Before we do that, watch out for spam, WhatsApp, and the comments down below. Also, feel free to join VIP to be alerted if we get in and out of plays. VIP going crazy. Like I told you guys, Party City up over 140% in a day. I don't think no other YouTubers, nobody was talking about that stock. I put everybody up on game with that, guys. Of course, some people already knew. Not everybody like that. Just seeing everybody over here in my space. But anyways, guys, you already know what to do. Also, Bed Bath & Beyond, we already made bread off that. Plenty of money off that. I alerted it again right before closing, right before it made its next big move. So in this video, we want to be touching bases on Mullen Automotives and also Bed Bath & Beyond guys so i know a lot of people got this on their radar on a watch list so let's go ahead and take a look at it i thought i heard something but anyways mullen automotives ended the day at 38 cents right at 39 guys up over 5.6 percent on today guys as we know this been on our radars for for a little while we already made money on this in vip it didn't do its full potential yet but i don't have time to sit around wait around that money have to be elsewhere where something actually is moving at see how why y'all still waiting here that money was over there in party city working for me now i'm able to come back to this because party city you know it didn't reach its peak we going that's another time for another day still money to be made with it though like i say get in vip i'm gonna alert it tomorrow as soon as it deal pull back watch the price action i'm gonna get in i'm gonna get out for a crazy profit on party city tomorrow but i wouldn't buy these levels i'm waiting for the panic so you already know guys but you got to know where to get in at because if it say 66 cents and it dropped to 50 and you get in and then you could you got to know where to get in and get out at so anyways let's go ahead and take a uh, further look guys uh mullen automotives it ended at 38 39 cents the volume is still there over 159 million shares being traded today hit a uh, low of 36 cents today guys so if i take a look at it do my quick analyst mullen automotives got a support at 36 cents so if you was to play this that's your pivot point if it fall below 36 cents which most people don't tell you they leave you out there stranded i will sell everything get out and sell for a small loss that's me that's me do you though i'm just letting you know what the what the what the ta is and if we take a closer look we see that Mullen automotives have a resistance right around 40 cents it's at 39 so the next one penny tick it break above 40 we're going to see this bad boy revisit it's high for the week it is high for uh uh on january the 6th when they reach around 47 cents it could potentially shoot up there rather quickly guys once breaking 40 so you definitely want to have that on your radar and like i just told you i told you what to watch for support just in case it doesn't do that so now let's move along to uh Bed Bath and Beyond. Bed Bath and Beyond, guys, it ended at 243, up over 27% in a day, another 17% after hours, which we call this play. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful play. Bankruptcy, fears, and all that stuff. I told you guys, block out the noise. I ain't worried about it, not one bit. Over 113 million shares being traded today. Great sign, great sign of you know the traders, the community being there. And Bed Bath and Beyond going into tomorrow, guys, it did reach its, its point. It reached this sale point at 249 to it actually exceeded expectations, in my opinion, guys. But being for the fact that mean stocks is on the verge of running again, uh game stop taking off, AMC is about to take off tomorrow. We could see Bed Bath and Beyond go a little higher, but I do believe it could possibly be on its own wave as well. Meaning we could see AMC GME take off a little more, but Bed Bath and Beyond drop, you know, they don't be on which that is you know it's hard to really say that because they should be on the same frequency but that's just how i see it. i do believe bed bath and beyond took off a bit more aggressive than them and i told you guys that in previous videos go fact check it well i was like pay attention to bed bath and beyond because we know that could shoot off 40 percent 30 percent 100 percent while amc and gme the real mean stock plays the kings and it won't even do that that's how you know how they holding amc and gme back when they let other ones like bed bath and beyond party city without the community or you know the manpower behind it like gme and amc they let them do go up 100 percent today but won't let them do it so you already know guys but anyways with bed bath and beyond like i say i do believe believe you know me personally it's getting scary at this point right here at this level because as we know we do know what's going on and all that good stuff and we also know bed and beyond bed bath and beyond is you know it usually be trading around this price. It's getting close to the price that it's trading around. With the five dollar area, it, it trades around the five dollar, six dollar area. Then it'll spike up. It shot up in twenty twenty two in August around twenty three dollars. So it could be, you know, it could it could go crazy. It could go crazy. You never know. But like I say, it's running. 
you know, it's getting hot. It's getting hot. I would definitely be looking to pivot out. And the only way I say it's getting, it'll get more comfortable with me, in my opinion, is if it dip. It got to dip hard. And then I would, you know, I could see opportunity. But I washed my hands with uh, that one, guys. I made my money, and it could continue to go higher. But like I say, guys, nobody knows the exact point of when a stock is going to top out or bottom out. But from my knowledge and experience, I give it to you the best of my ability. And eight times, seven times out of ten, it usually be right on the T, guys. So you already know what to do. Edge above on Instagram at the Behave Show. Get in VIP. I love y'all. We out. And God bless you. We go.